Hi guys, it's me Jimmy a Geek. The first world mechanical keyboard laptop has announced by MSI MSI GT80 Titan. Indeed, it is a thick bag as Titan. Yes, this is a world first mechanical keyboard. MSI has already registered the name in the world history. They are going to register the name in the the world record. The first mechanical keyboard, why the hell nobody ever dare like Sony, Lenovo, Acer, HP never dare to make a mechanical keyboard because let me show you, this is a mechanical keyboard. The keys are very very thick. If you make this size of keyboard and put this size of keyboard on the laptop, the laptop is going to be thick like an ass like this. But the sad part of the story is MSI GT80 is a thick brick like this nobody wanna buy only a gamer buy if i really buy why the hell should i buy i will buy a desktop basically you know sorry basically msi gt80 titan is a desktop replacement you couldn't carry it will be around 4 kg it will be really heavy why should i really i, should, I just go and buy a normal mechanical keyboard basically it's a repo v500 I will just go and buy a normal mechanical keyboard and then connect to a desktop or oh, you know what this keyboard is connected to my laptop right now if I really buying a desktop replacement I wouldn't buy MSI GT Titan I will just buy a normal gaming laptop and then connect my keyboard or I will just carry a like this mechanical keyboard I am really does not think this the new MSI GT80 Titan is going to be a success in any way. My personal opinion is it is going to be flop. It is a gimmick like the AMD processor. What was it called? 970, 970, I don't know, 9570, something like that. The 5 gigahertz processor. The world was streaming 5 gigahertz, but it was a gimmick. Nobody want to use the 5 gigahertz at 220 TDP watts. It is run like a freaking hot sun. It's so hot the motherboard burn. Sometimes sometimes the things are good in paper or just as a gimmick. The MSI GT80 Titan is a gimmick. Like there was a laptop, I forgot the manufacturer name. I don't I think it was Acer. They make a laptop with dual screen. Like this. Dual screen. Here was a screen. Instead of putting the keyboard, they place a full touch screen. You have to use a touch screen to type. It was a really good idea, it was a gimmick but flop and then there was a tablet released by Sony, I really didn't remember the model number, the tablet was like a, like a flip, when you open the tablet it becomes full, it's a really good, it was really portable but it was a gimmick, indeed yes MSI GT8 Titan is a gimmick, it is just gonna flop, nobody really will ever remember the name, like I didn't remember the name which was a really cool idea but they flopped. So if you are thinking what the hell inside it will have, it will have 9 GTX 980 graphic card with 8 gig of RAM, the 8 gig of the GDDR RAM with the 5th generation i7, not the 4th generation, 5th generation i7. Basically, now it's a question mark, will it come with Windows 8 or Windows 10? My personal opinion is it will come with Windows 10, but Apple Windows 10 will be out. So that's all, basically it's using the you will ask me which kind of mechanical keyboard is using it is using the cherry brown mx switch basically cherry brown mx switch, switch i recommend for the first time user and then my mechanical keyboard is using the orange switch very hard to find the orange switch keyboard you just google it you change my name to something else if you can easily find our orange switch keyboard there's only razor orange switch keyboard or this is a repo v500 orange switch keyboard so I will say do not wait for this laptop, just buy another laptop or you are just waiting for the i7 i fifth generation, just wait, MSI GT80 Titan, indeed it is a Titan from 1980s, not from 2014, subscribe to my channel, please like my video, please leave your comment below, I always answer the comments whenever you leave, whichever question you have, please feel to ask me and then I will give you my honest answer and please visit gmail.com bye bye